Yeah, it totally depends on the company that you're interviewing with and what their process is. I've done everything from having a single informal interview on campus with maybe a video call um, to an additional person on the team um, to doing the fuller kind of phone interview, followed by phone interview, followed by on-site interview. So it totally varies, um, but very much so the format tends to be very similar in what we're trying to learn from a candidate in an interview. So one, it's just making sure that you have the core skills and understanding for actually developing and executing research and research studies. And then the other part of it is understanding sort of how you approach methodologies and different projects. So for instance, with research, there's never necessarily any one right method to go after. With each method, there are pros and cons to choosing a methodology. So oftentimes, we'll try and figure out through a hypothetical question, what methodology would you choose and why? And how do you kind of weigh those different pros and cons? And then how flexible and open are you to new constraints being added to the, the problem? So for instance, maybe your budget will change, or maybe they'll ask you to run it in a smaller time frame. They want to see how do you adapt to that? And do you change your methodology? Because that's a lot of the real world stuff that we deal with. And then lastly, we'll oftentimes try and understand how do you work with your stakeholders? How do you involve them in the research process? Um, so I think that's kind of what you can expect from a UBooks research interview.